Fighting and training, it's always a learning experience. Win or lose, if you want to succeed, you always have to be ready and willing to learn. I've been doing karate and other martial arts pretty much my whole life. Most people see the sort of physical side of, of martial arts. They see the sort of violence in it. But for me, it's always been about self-development and self-progression. I think it's sort of tough to prove yourself in martial arts without ever actually stepping in the ring. I think that's something I really wanted to do. You know, I wanted to take that next step to see how far I could take myself with it. There's definitely a huge difference between being kind of regular fit and being fight fit. So leading up to the fight, I was ramping up my training, so about four or five times a week, and then finally moving into about six times a week sometimes. There's a lot of training to be done. So at the venue, there had been this um, upstairs kind of balcony, which is where all the fighters had been getting warmed up. I remember them taking the gloves off and then putting on the, the competition gloves, taping them up, and then me walking over to the stairwell. And then the next thing I know, I'm up in the ring, I'm staring across, there's my opponent. And then all I hear is the ref say, fight. Now, what's the end result of the fight? So the night before the fight, uh, my coach gave me this book to read. In that book was the mindset. If you make it all about that win, it puts way too much pressure on you and puts way too much pressure on your mind. The win might come and, you know, the win might not come. Really, at the end of the day, it's about putting in as much effort as you can. For me, it's really nice to just be able to know that I have this in me, you know, that I can commit to something like this, that I have the dedication for it.